Hello everyone, this is Hiratmania. Welcome back to my playthrough of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess for the GameCube. Previously, Link advanced to the boss door in Hyrule Castle. Where's Princess Zelda? We have to find her and save her. Yes, indeed. Fortunately, we've opened up shortcuts. So, let's get underway. Thank you, camera. Here is a shortcut. into the central tower. Now through this disaster area again. Then here we need the claw shot. To put it more exactly, double claw shots. Then the spinner. There we are. And now we're at the boss door. We're out here now, and we have to go upstairs. Very interesting. Sort of makes me think of something out of Dark Souls, but this was before Dark Souls. And in here. Let's see what we find. Oh dear. Anyone got super glue? Hmm, there's Zelda. Welcome to my castle. <laughs> you are very much mistaken, sir. So you're Ganondorf. <laughs> oh, still wounded, I see. Hmm. 
I've been dying to meet you. <laughs> Your people have long amused me, Midna. To defy the gods with such petty magic, only to be cast aside. How very pathetic. <laughs> pathetic as they were, though, they served me well. Their anguish was my nourishment. Their hatred bled across the void and awakened me. I drew deep of it and grew strong again. Your people had some skill, to be sure, but they lacked true power. The kind of absolute power that those chosen by the gods wield. The Triforce, you mean? He who wields such power would make a suitable king for this world, don't you think? I disagree. Ha! Huh, such conceit! But if you are one of the chosen wielders of power, as you claim, I will risk everything to deny you! Shadow has been moved by light, it seems. How amusing! Very well. Deny me, then. Yes, try to deny me. You and your little friend. What are you doing? Seems he's picked up some tricks from your world, Midna. Oh dear. <laughs> Crud. Looks like Link is alone. Both of you, faithless fools who would dare to take up arms against the King of Light and Shadow. <laughs> so you choose, and so you shall feel my wrath. So now we have to fight Ganon's puppet, Zelda. We have to bat back light at her. Like so. A familiar theme. Avoid that light. Most definitely. Take that, Ganon. My condolences, Zelda. Oh, avoid that. Again, avoid that. <laughs> Here we are. Sorry about that, Zelda. Ganon was using you. All right there, Midna. 
<laughs> Look out, Ganondorf! Let my princess go! Oh dear, what is he up to now? <laughs> He's becoming a beast. How very Ganon like. Dark Beast Ganon. This guy loves to teleport around. He'll come in through a random teleporter. One that's blue. There he is. Here he comes. Knock him on his side and strike his wound. Just like that, Link, dodge his charge and attack his stomach after he stops. Now be careful, he likes to come off the ceiling. Just so. So sorry to wound you, Ganon. There we are. Now after that, he is going to change things up a little. We'll have to be in wolf form to take him down this time. Very nice, Midna. So sorry, Ganon. Did I hurt your belly? Ah, so Zelda's energy is going back to her. Pr princess I... I... Say nothing, Midna. 
Your heart and mine were as one, however briefly. Such suffering you have endured. I guess it's not over yet. Vile fiend. I guess she doesn't want you to stop her, Link. Yes, it's fortunate we don't have to fight her like that. Well, we're out on the field. Uh-oh. Property destruction. Well, well, there he is. And it's Midna's helmet. You vile creep. Spirits of the Light, wielders of the great power that shines far and wide upon the lands of our world. In my hour of need, grant me the light to banish evil. And they're gone. Our lovely guardian spirits. And it appears they're giving her the light arrows. Link? Chosen hero. Lend us the last of your power. Absolutely, Zelda. Let's go take down Ganondorf. I'll try to slow Ganondorf with my light arrows. You target him and keep him within range of my arrows. You jerk. Darn you. Avoid that.
you in this Zelda. There we are. Take that, Ganondorf. Oh, too bad he didn't roll over on you. <laughs> Why laughest thou? An impressive looking blade. But nothing more. Would you hear my desire? To take this foul blade and use it to blot out the light forever. You vile villain. Dark Lord Ganondorf. Time for a real sword fight against him. Oh, your energy barrier does damage, does it? does not care for back attacks, it seems. Stupid barrier.
add your kicks, sir. Time to tap A with this chance. Finish him! Oh, so sorry, Ganondorf. Was that me? Some god you are. Do not think this ends here. The history of light and shadow will be written in blood. Ta ta for now, Ganon. Even Zant doesn't like you. Ah, it's the Guardian Spirits. And there's Midna. Feeling all right there, Midna. Oh, something's different about her. Has she been returned to normal? Looks like she has. Actually, a pretty beautiful woman. What? Say something. Am I so beautiful that you've no words left? He is kind of taciturn, Midna. So, Midna is restored. And that is the end of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Almost. Quite a fine game. Definitely some well-designed dungeons. Interesting bosses, excellent music, 
and Midna makes for quite an interesting character. You start off thinking she's pretty nasty, but she turns out to be alright in the end. And of course, like any self-respecting main series game, the main villain is Ganondorf. Or Ganon. <laughs> There's King Bulban roaming the fields. I wonder if he's doing good or evil. And it appears that the Ordon children are getting ready to leave Kakariko Village. Ah, the old overworld theme. Always a delight. Phyton Gorons. And here's Telmo's Bar. That rat fink doctor. And her delightful cat Louise. I wonder if Telma was inspired by Queen Latifah. The Castle Town Square. Looks like everyone's dancing in the streets. Well, well. Colin has armed himself. Zora's domain. Looks like the queen is looking over her son. And the beautiful Lake Hylia. The gang is still trooping back to Ordon Village. Beautiful tree on the left. And Mount Snow Peak. Need any Ordon repairmen, snowmen? All a heart. I wonder if they're making a baby Yeti. The Temple of Time. Being duly studied. My one gripe is there's no way to control the day-night cycle. That kind of makes Poe hunting a bit of a bear. Ah, looks like Uli has given birth.
and everyone's back home. Just about everyone. The Gerudo Desert. And the Arbiter's Grounds. Seems to me those Twilight have served enough time. Well, I guess this is farewell, huh? Light and shadow can't mix, as we all know. But... Never forget that there's another world bound to this one. Shadow and light are two sides of the same coin. One cannot exist without the other. I know now the reason the goddesses left the Mirror of Twilight in this world. They left it because it was their design that we should meet. Yes, that is what I believe. Zelda, your words are kind, and your heart is true. If all on Hyrule are like you, then maybe you'll do all right. Thank you. Well, the princess spoke truly. As long as that mirror's around, we could meet again. Link? I... See you later. I think she has feelings for him. Goodbye, Midna. It looks like forever. What a magnificent game! A little more credit rolling.
Rainbow Temple of Time. And the Master Sword sleeps forever. What's up, buddy? Waiting for Link to come home. Well, here he comes. Truly a fine job. The end. That concludes this playthrough of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess for the GameCube. I've enjoyed making this playthrough, and I hope you've enjoyed watching. This is Hey Rotlinia. I'd like to thank you for watching, and I hope to see you again in my other playthroughs. Thank you and goodbye.